we got some more Gold Series Bonanza reveals today. Make sure you guys smash the little crap out of that subscribe button so you guys don't miss out on more awesome content. Fetching your fearsome flip monster since 2002. So, Sangin is getting a quarter century out here. I'm not really too surprised to be seeing this, considering the fact that Sangin was basically the searcher back in the day. You know, any sort of flip effect monster, especially back in the game's era of, uh, how do you say, slower times. I actually think that this was actually pretty cool. We also had the linchpin for the first majorly competitive hero deck, which was Hero City 2, aka, I believe this was for, was it, there was Little City, Big City, and Mid City. Holy crap, that takes me back. The hero control options were very, very cool back in the day. You had so many options available to you. But Hero City 2 allowed basically the heroes to float and allowed you this wide range of control options to be available. So seeing Hero City 2 getting this reprint, it's not really a popular older format, but I, I think that's really cool. Hard to expect since barely anyone had one back then. Uh, this is true. Morphing Jar was one of those cards that was so exclusive and so rare for its time. Also being available as a TP2 Ultra Rare and as a TP4 Super Rare. It was one of those things that like, man, you had to be rich in order to have one of these. So the fact that, you know, we're getting the reprint for that was really, really cool. We also do have a reprint on Magician of Faith with the text, get back pot, don't mind if I do. Yeah, I don't really remember that being back the response, but it was, uh, I'll go ahead and I'll draw two more cards and you're not gonna be able to do anything about it. And then we have Jirak Gawaiba getting a QCR, part of the infamous Dino Rabbit deck, which Forbidden Lance in this, um, the fact that they chose Gawaiba over Lance is a little bit disappointing as a choice, but I'm here for it. Um, it's not exactly what I what I wanted to see, but I guess we're kind of in an era right now of things that looking, I guess, a little bit acceptable to say that. So today's reveals were, in comparison to yesterday's, are very, very subpar. You know, you have some good choices here, but so many more things I think a lot of us are wanting to see with this set, but I'll take these kind of as, you know, the introduction part two. <laughs> this would have felt like the better thing, but Crush Card is on the table now, so I'm waiting to see how that goes. So please, if you comment down below, tell me what you guys think. See your beautiful faces back here later in the day, guys. Peace out. Patrons, thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Check out these other videos.